What is going on, Phantom Army? It's your boy Phantom Stilts, and welcome back once again to Far Cry 5. It was not lying. We are going to jump right back into this adventure. I hope you guys are excited. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. That way you guys don't miss any new content, gameplay streams, live streams, gameplay walkthroughs, reaction videos, anything on the channel. Go check out the channel. I guarantee you guys will like something on the channel. Something will catch your interest, I guarantee it. But without any further ado, we're going to jump right back into Far Cry 5 here. So last episode, we took down Faith once and for all. She was the second tier, and uh, actually she was the third tier in uh, Jacob Seed's uh, cultist movement uh, involving Eden's Gate. And then now we are heading to take down Jacob Seed, who is the last person that we have to take down in the cultist movement before we get to Jacob and actually take down the entire thing of, of, uh, of Eden's Gate. So I hope you guys are excited. Make sure to like and subscribe, like I said. And let's get right back into it, guys. Here we go. So we are headed here to go dig down or liberate uh barren lumber mill and that is the first mission that we actually have within jacob seeds uh region so that's where we're headed right now not too far away about 200 meters we're coming up on it here pretty fast let's go ahead and go on foot from here because we might need to do some scouting before we get all the way there Go ahead and switch to our uh, assault rifle here. Gonna do a little bit of scouting here. There's a guy over there. Empires always crumble. And I believe I have Grace with me. Is that who's with me? Yeah, okay. This is our final warning. This is our final collapse. Looks like we got one alarm we can take care of. Go take this down this guy up here on the scaffolding quietly. And when the moment finally comes, we will be ready. Take him out. Mother Nature doesn't care who you are or where you came from. She eliminates our conscience and empathy. Only the strong soul. Oh! Watch out! Oh, we destroyed one of the alarms. They still might have another one. I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and go up here. They know we're here, obviously, so... Gotta deal with that. They can't call. It looks like there's only one alarm on the premises, so they can't call for reinforcements, so that's good. This ladder here. I think these guys don't even know I'm here. that up. Alright, so... Then we got... Grace is right there. Take this guy out. Looks like we got more guys that we gotta deal with. Go down this ladder, go on the opposite side of the uh, the scaffolding. There's a guy right here. Machine gun. There we go. Oh! Go back up, go back up, go back up! Don't have any med kits, so we gotta regen some health here. And realize there was another guy down there. There he is. Nice shot.
That was actually relatively simple. I expected there to be a lot more resistance than that. Uh, let's see. New character reveal, just black. Yeah, real hard, kid. I can't believe those fuckers were keeping folks prisoners there. Waiting for their indoctrination. <sighs> Thanks for springing Jess. That Nisamon is as tough as nails, but she's got a nag for trouble. So many people being check in on her for me, would you? For sure. Let's go talk to Jess here, see what she's got to say. What's up, girl? Need your help. It's important. Thanks for busting me out. Name's Jess. If you're out here picking fights with the cult, then I'm guessing you already know my Uncle Dutch. Look, I don't got a lot of time to waste. I'm gonna get right to the point. I was on the trail of one of Jacob's zealots. Goes by the name The Cook. Yeah, don't sound so scared. <laughs> but believe me, he's one twisted fuck. Oh, good times. Almost tracked him good down. Times. But a Peggy patrol got the drop on me. I need your help. We can't let this trail go cold. If you're looking to hook up with the Whitetails, this could be your way in. And more importantly, you'd help put an evil motherfucker in the grave. Gotta move. Wasted too much time already. Follow me. Alrighty. This way. Hutton's boring. No skill. See that? That's his calling card. Innocent people burned alive. Oh, that's fun. So he's a little bit of a pyro, it sounds like. Goddamn cults grabbing everyone. They'll take you from your home, the bar, even church. Don't matter where you are. Then they slot you into one of two categories. Weak or strong. See, Jacob's building an army. And anyone who can't or won't fight for him winds up dead. Cullen the herd, he calls it. Wholesale slaughter innocent people. Nobody believed it was happening because nobody wanted to believe. Jacob sees in charge out here. He's ex-military, he's a combat veteran, and he's a psycho. Oh, I'm getting too far away from the ally. Not good. Where's she at? Don't want to do that. What's up, girl? Where are we going? Then there's the one we're after. The cook. He's one of Jacob's favorites. The one who leads his purging. The cook's bought into all of Jacob's bullshit. But this motherfucker's gonna get what he deserves. Which is the vantage point with Jess, okay? I don't see him anywhere. Treats people like fucking animals. Switching to the cages. Can't do anything from here. Okay, let's do this. But keep your head down. They spy us until the cages are dead. Okay, liberate the hostages at the camp. Hostages remaining three out of three. Okay, oh my gosh, he's gonna see us. Oh, 
Oh my god, save me. Save me. Save me. Oh my god. Alright, where's the last hostage at? Over here. Okay. What's up, fool? Dislocate my shoulder. I bet I could get through. Nobody's looking. Get me out of here. Go through the top? How the hell do we get you out of this cage? Oh, Jess is gonna do it. Okay. Or maybe she's not. Just kidding. Uh. Somebody got the Peggy's all riled up. Was it you? Well, they won't try that again. It's cool. I'm sure they'll let me go. I got you. Hey, the hostages. Bust him out of the cage. I'd be six feet under if you didn't save me. Thanks. The cook. He. He took others. Okay. Took him up the mountain. Moving. You're not from around here, are you? You want to know why they call him the cook? A couple years back, Jacob sent one of his guys out to round up his family. Parents and kids. First thing he did was starve them. Gave him nothing. Not even a drop of water. After three days, oh my God. he was so thirsty they had to drink their own piss. But the kids didn't want to do it. So the parents forced it down their throats. The kids puked it right back up. Cook didn't like that. So he went and strung the parents up on posts under the hot Jesus sun. God. Yes, you got family? Who's looking after you? Me, myself, and I. That's fine. <clears throat> when this all shakes out, my door is open. Sure. Hold up. I think I heard something. Alright, so we gotta go... The next vantage point looks like. Getting a better angle. They're gonna execute him. Take point. I got your back. Remember, if they spot us. Those people are dead on sight. Okay, so gotta sort of do this quietly as much as we can. Watch out, Jess. Alright. So what's the best way to come at this? Probably actually if we got any more. I'm on move. We got piggies. Oh, there's a guy right here too. Two guys right here. One. Please don't leave. Thank you for saving my ass. Please help me. My. And we got one out of three, which is not a good percentage, but at least we passed the mission. Yeah, the parents on posts and decided to give the kids a little water. We're past this part of the mission, this checkpoint. If they were hungry. The kids were starving, so they said yes. Started 
begging for food. Cook asked if they want pork. Kid said yes. So he went out to the parents and took their shoes off and started to play. This little piggy went to market and the blood poured like a damned faucet. Cook had a big old grin on his face as he offered each little piece to the kids. I've heard a lot of fucked up things are happening in these mountains. Pretty soon there were no more piggies left. So he laughed and set the parents on fire. And the air filled up with that sickly sweet smell of roasted flesh. Jesus. I'll never forget that smell. Oh, there's somebody when they finally getting tortured, it sounds like. That sounds like fun. Of course, I'm being facetious, that sounds like hell. Vanished like some sort of demon in the night. Anyways, that's why they call him the cook. Oh my god. About the fire. Nice. That's a better death than that piece of shit deserved. Talk to Jess, okay. Where's she at? What's up, girl? That was right. Cook's dead, and I don't feel anything. All I ever wanted was to find this guy, and now I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Bam. That just been right about a lot of shit lately. The cult, Eli. Maybe he's right about you too. You uh, you need someone to watch your back. Call me. And, uh, thanks for everything you've done. Alright guys, so that's where we're going to end the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. We took out the cook. That's one of the main constituents of Jacob Seed, it sounds like. But without any further ado, this is your boy Phantom Stilts. I will see you guys on the next Far Cry 5 gameplay video. Take care, guys.